There's nothing you can do about it, right? Uh, it's not the first time we lost by a buzzer beater in the finals, I think. All bets on sport! The energy flows! One is bet, this is your victory! There's a lot of talk about what happened in, at the end of game one, but uh, how were you able to keep your focus? Uh, the team's There's nothing you can do about it, right? Uh, it's not the first time we lost by a buzzer beater in the finals, I think. Uh, Japit might have hit a buzzer beater on us in the finals before. Um, even against these guys, uh, it wasn't a buzzer beater, but Josh Smith made a game winner, and I think it was in game one as well. So you just got to move on. You got to have a short memory. You can't change the call. You can't protest, whatever. You just move on. It's a seven-game series. You move on and try to win the next game. So that's what we did. Now we got to be even better in game three because we know they're going to make adjustments. We got to be even better and come out with a lot more energy and and, and, and more focus and try to get another one. Chris, uh, you, have, you had a friendly chat with JC the last time. Yeah. Uh, do you know uh, the two of you have been friends before? I've known JC for... Man, I was maybe second year here, maybe since 2010, 20, 2009. He was in college, so I've known him for a long time. We've kept in contact, and I mean, that's my guy, man. Like, as soon as he came in, we, we, we met up that day, uh, just chilled, uh, had a good time, and I love um, But that's my guy. Hopefully, on Monday, I'm not, as, I'm not too tired to watch their game. Uh, I go there and support them. I know, I know it's a big deal for him to be here and to put put the jersey on and just represent. And hopefully I'll be there with him. Because I remember I remember one of our first conversations I had when I learned he was Filipino. I was like, bro, I was like, your main goal obviously is NBA, but the Philippines ain't bad, bro. Like, then when he got drafted, I was like, you got, you're with the Lakers, bro? Like, there's a huge Filipino community there. Take advantage of that shit. Take advantage of that stuff. Uh, and... Uh, like, and, and he knew, he knew he, he's, he's well versed, his mom's a Filipina, so, um, I mean, he took advantage, and every time he comes here, he, every time he wants to come a lot, but his schedule doesn't permit, and I know he feels all the love, and he just loves being here, so hopefully this is second or third of many that he gets.